My name is Brian Anderson. I'm with O'Reilly Media, and we're here at Velocity Santa Clara 2014. I'm speaking with Brian Bukowski, uh, CTO and founder of Aerospike. So, Brian, uh, tell me a little bit about Aerospike. Uh, you know, there's a lot of NoSQL databases out there. You know, what, why Aerospike? So, Aerospike is the fastest of the NoSQL databases. NoSQL is known for speed, and people reach for NoSQL databases when they're looking to go beyond the speed of some of the old relational systems. They're looking to use big data. They're looking for a higher velocity, usually, than was previously accomplished. So it's often used in cases where you want a key value store, uh, you want session manager, etc., or even if you want a super fast, reliable cache. That's really where Aerospike shines. Mm -hmm. So who is using Aerospike? You know, are there some use cases you could describe? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, we have probably the broadest range of customers, um, and folks have really pushed the limits of scale and reliability. The primary users of Aerospike in a large scale uh, among our paid customers are within the advertising community. So these are the guys who are keeping billions of profiles and accessing them in milliseconds with extraordinarily high reliability. So I'll be talking a little later with one of our customers, these guys called AppNexus, who are one of the premier advertising bidding platforms. Uh, but to give you an example, a lot of folks use us at scales of millions of transactions per second with a, a small handful of servers. Mm -hmm. So, you know, compared to some of the other NoSQL databases, we're often 10 times faster when tested by our customers. Mm -hmm. So not only can we do an in, are we an in-memory solution, and we're an in-memory NoSQL solution, we also support Flash. So the ability to run at very high velocities over terabytes of data. Folks can just do new things when presented with a data layer this fast, this reliable. Mm -hmm. Great. Uh, and what else is sort of different about Aerospike, you know, in terms of unique value proposition? So we've started really as a clustered, reliable database, and it is a database with ACID properties. So a lot of the NoSQL guys, you know, there's played fast and loose with some of the definitions of SQL. Uh, my co-founder is University of Wisconsin PhD databases and worked at uh, IBM Almaden. Uh, so our database fundamentals are very strong in terms of ACID support. So uh, folks in financial services who are starting to use NoSQL databases simply because they need to, to understand customers and use customer data on the fly, uh, those guys really appreciate the kind of data reliability that we have that goes beyond what is commonly available in NoSQL, but now at a velocity that is much higher than has previously been accomplished. Millions of transactions per second per server in high availability clusters on garden variety hardware. Great, and I also I wanted to ask you uh, finally. You know, there was just an announcement that you guys have gone open source. Uh, you know, even closed source for for a while. You know, uh, why now? So our announcement today covers three things, and that is the fact that Aerospike will be open source. It is open source now. It's available at GitHub.com Aerospike slash Aerospike server, and second of all, a new funding round for the company of twenty million dollars. That's led by some of the largest and most uh, uh, oldest VC firms in Silicon Valley, as well as new customer, New Star. New Star is at the center of the telecom system because they do call completion, call forwarding, and um, uh, uh, portability, as well as DNS. So, Airspikes open source initiatives and funding really go hand in hand. Mm -hmm. We found that investors now really understand the new economy of open source and how open source and enterprises work together. They want us to attack a billion dollar market as all VCs do. And so the way that enterprise software is consumed and sold is changed and trust, databases are about trust. So. Open source is also about trust. It's about showing the code of what you've done and allowing architects, data engineers, to really see what you're doing inside. And as the database, NoSQL database, with the highest performance numbers and the best benchmark numbers, we are happy to have people see the code and use it and involve that trust. So the fact that data architects, everyone can now use Aerospike, it's really about adoption. That's really what has attracted the VCs to put down even more money into this effort and allow us to attack and help us attack an even bigger market. Mm -hmm. Great. Well, thank you very much, Brian, for your time. Thank you, Brian. Mm -hmm.